Hi, my name is Jennifer. I'm graduating from the Environmental Protection University, and this is my last summer vacation as a student. I'm on my way to visit my grandpa Jack, a famous oceanographer. He's an amazing storyteller. Can't wait to see him. Hi, Grandpa. Hi, Jenny. I'm so glad to see you. Come on in. What's new? You're a straight-A marine biology student. What do you mean Old Barney won't hire you without a trial period? For a start, Old Barney's Aquarium is the largest marine conservation center in the world. It's won the best aquarium title three years in a row. Besides, I love challenges. I'm not scared of a task like that. Maybe I'll just phone up Old Barney? No, please, don't do it. I'll create an excellent aquarium and get this job fairly. It's a shame, though. I've only got enough money for one fish. Offering you money is pointless, I guess. You know me. I want to do everything myself. Thanks for asking, though. It's great that you want to make your own way in life, but let me give you one piece of advice. This is your fish tank, but it's empty. Luckily, we can fix that. Let's work out what fish species could call it home. Wow, this is a flame angelfish. My first pet fish. I hope it brings us luck. better. Let's add some water plants. The fish will love them. But, but now I'm almost out of money. It's not really a problem. I also had trouble finding money at the beginning of my marine studies. Then I got an idea. We found all kinds of junk at the bottom of the sea. Stuff that was useless both for science and the marine environment. But on shore, these knickknacks made us a fortune. We sold some things as souvenirs, others got recycled. Got it? Great idea. Shall we go diving? Try to find something from the list below. I think we can turn it into cash. you woke up all these fishies, but it's pretty easy to drive them away. some money. I think it's time to buy some ornaments for your fish tank. I'm sure my flame angelfish will love this soft water plant. Where shall I put it? Barney will probably use the standard requirements to assess your fish tank. Make sure your fish are diverse and your tank is beautiful and comfortable. 
sure if you fill up all your meters to 100%, you'll convince Barney you're the best. That's all the advice I can give you for now. Good luck. antique store has been dreaming about a collection of ancient Greek vases. will help you in a difficult situation.
of the sea sparkles with heaps of gold, but it's guarded by sharks. Dare we dive in? Don't stay underwater too long. where I keep recordings and research papers. This aquarium is really pretty, but practice makes perfect. Earn a star in the pirate aquarium. Hi, my name is Jennifer. I'm good. The pirate aquarium is...
Diving without a scuba? Grab the first item you find.
you filled up all the meters. Amazing job. I'm sure that now Barney won't think twice about hiring you. Hello? Is this Jennifer Richards? Yes, it's me. Hi, this is Mr. Harrison, the head of the Water is Life Foundation. Hi, Mr. Harrison. Hi, Jennifer. It's very nice to speak to you. I have always been positive that Jack's granddaughter will make a worthy successor to him. I'm sorry, Mr. Harrison. I don't quite understand. I'm talking about your work at Oceans Alive. But I'm still not 100% sure that everything worked out. I dropped by Oceans Alive the other day and talked to Barney Keltman. He said he's hiring you. Oh, that's great. It goes without saying that you'll be officially informed of your post. I can't wait to learn what project I'm going to be part of. This is going to be an entirely new project for Oceans Alive. The topic is truly fascinating. Pirate Aquarium. Hey, I noticed you got another fish tank. Looks great. Perhaps you will want to continue working on your Hawaiian aquarium. But Barney is really looking forward to your work on the pirate one. This aquarium is really pretty, but practice makes perfect. Earn a star in the pirate aquarium. <laughs> 